uh, CLF starting to come up against the T-line. It's making a new day high. Uh, starting to break out over yesterday's volume. It's running up, up almost 70%, 69% of uh, the average, the 10-day volume. Nothing to write home about. Um, I, I do think this is setting up very nice. A pop over the T-line, it'll it'll uh, should run up to the 20. Uh, currently with an entry of uh, $20.81 uh, and 1,600 shares, uh, so far doing pretty darn good in this. Very happy with my CLF trade. HZ was another big winner uh, today, and I think it's still going to move higher. Now, I've sold mine, uh, protecting those profits, looking for the possibility of a pullback tomorrow or even consolidation, especially if the market's pulling back. Uh, I'd rather collect what I have here than try to stretch it out uh, higher. You can see that this had a gap, and then we ran up over the uh, big three, consolidated, and now we're moving up. That's just a perfect picture of a rounded bottom breakout. IAG has been another nice trade coming off the bottom. Thanks, GG, for this one. Uh, came up over the T-line pinball setup, and it's just sort of moved up ever since. Tagged the 34, now doing a little bit of a pullback. CLF popping up. We've moved up to 0.72, 70% of, of the past 10 day average, still holding at 0 0.9 or 0 0.8, normalized volume. You see it popping in, new day high. Uh, close over the T line, that should make a pretty decent pinball setup. Oh, yeah, nice pinball setup. Okay, let's. Um, 